a long time ago, when you were little, I wrote you a letter, and um, the letter's 20 years old. After we were married and trying to have children, we, we couldn't have kids, so we adopted a son, and then 11 years later, God sent Brooke to us. Being adopted, I wanted them to know how much I loved her, and I just thought it would be extremely precious when she opened it up and read it on her wedding day. We want to welcome you here today to celebrate this beautiful day, this wedding ceremony with Tyler and Brooke. And this is the day where we look into Genesis chapter 2 and be reminded that God said it is not good that the man should be alone. letter that I wrote you. December the 15th, 1994. Our dear little baby Brooke, as I write this to you, you're sleeping soundly in your baby bed. We just want you to know how much love and happiness you've brought to our family. A precious little baby girl to daddy and me, and a baby sister to Brian. Seems like just the other day, <laughs> there was this little freckle-faced girl. <laughs> knocking on my door, <laughs> aggravating me, or, or I was chasing her down the hall with a vacuum cleaner. <laughs> but I love you, and Tyler. I mean, I couldn't have handpicked a better man. Before Daddy and I were married, we always said, if we had a little girl, she would be a little book and you are our little baby book. <laughs> You're special, and God sent you to us for us to love you. It's perfect. I now pronounce you husband and wife, and you may kiss your bride. 